Hey guys, today I'm playing Unturned, which, um, well, I haven't started in the menu because every time I start in the menu and record, it crashes, um, because indie games, uh, and this is my fourth attempt at recording because it's crashed so much, and Fraps has been like, I'm gonna record your file system, not the game, so, not in a great mood. Um, but this is a weird little game. It's, um, should be the most generic game in the world. It's, um, an indie game, so everything right now. It uses these, you know, fairly basic block graphics in a nice way, actually. Um, and it's a zombie survival game. So it's an indie, uh, indie, I think an alpha game. So an indie alpha basic graphic zombie survival game. So basically every game in the world right now. Um, so it should be like everything else. However, it seems kind of different in some ways. Ma the main thing is um, it's not easy because a lot of zombie games, I, I, I never get tired of zombie games. I'm one of those people who will love zombie games until the day I die. And zombie films. Zombies are great. They never get old um, because they're dead. <laughs> but um, it's, I don't know, it's I like, um, the zombies aren't easy to kill. They're not easy to kill and you don't start with loads of guns and you're never really equipped enough to kill, say, that amount of zombies. This, like, if there's more than, like, one zombie, or maybe two zombies, if you're lucky, you're gonna die. Um, I haven't played it much, and I haven't really figured out how to survive yet. The only way I've been able to survive for a long period of time is to glitch it, and it's not an indie game, so, you know, it's really easy to glitch. Um, I might even be able to do it here. Usually corners allow you to glitch. Oh, no. Okay, nope, nope, die. Uh, please let there be a gun. Oh, yeah, I think this will let me glitch it. Yep, that'll go away. Um, so I can talk. <laughs> Ooh, magazine. That's nice. Uh, if you look at my... You can only carry, like, four things as well, and I'm naked, because... Why not? A weird little slide bar for rotation. Um, very indie. Um... Okay, let's see if I can run away. Uh... But yeah, it's really hard, basically. I've never been able to survive very long without sofa glitching. Um, if basically, if there's a corner with a sofa in it, just stand in the corner and you'll be fine. Um, that's my tip for the game. My only tip. The other tip is to run and jump and don't use up all your energy. And I'm almost dead. Um, again. Have I died so far? I don't know. I've done so many recordings now because of glitching that I... <gasps> An actual gun! A real life gun! Oh! Oh no! no. Oh. oh, that's depressing. Even, that gun wouldn't help me, though, because I probably would have had, like, maybe five shots at the most in it, and that's enough to kill maybe maybe five zombies if you're good. Um, but you can beat them to death. If there's one, they're not that bad. So, you know, you just kind of punch him, run away, stay out of his reach. Although he got me there, and I am a little infected. You can see these stats at the bottom. Um, maybe as you level up. Oh, yeah, I just got experience. I reckon it's leveling up that makes um, you better. That would make sense. And maybe at some point you can build yourself a protective place. I th I don't know, because if you can get good at this game, and if you can um, play this uh, well and survive, it is probably a very good game. And probably is a lot of fun to play. But if it just stays like this, it just sounds frustrating. Um, I'm not really sure, but I have some guns now. And I'm very happy. This is... Ooh, I actually have guns. Nice. That'll be my backup. Right. Let's go look around. I need to find some food as well. Um, that's bolts. Might as well take some bolts. Although you can only carry like four things. So it might be best to not just carry bolts. Um, oh, thank God. He's dead. Holy crap, I'm actually not... Oh, shit. Okay, that went poorly, even though I found a machine gun. Yeah, um, like I said, I get the feeling it could just be a really good game, or just kind of be terrible. I think you have to be kind of thinking about how you're going to play it to play it, basically. And it, I think, I'm not really sure, I don't know if there's a map, I've forgotten the controls. 
Um, but there are vehicles and stuff, and it does look like a pretty big map. And I think there are servers, so there probably is a multiplayer, and I think with multiplayer, it could be pretty good, but I don't... Um, I don't have anyone to play with right now, which is kind of annoying. But uh, maybe at some point I'll set that up. Uh, yeah. Um, but it is free on Steam, so it's not... So I do actually urge you to play this, um, because it is kind of... It is a bit of fun, and it can just be a nice hour slash... A, hour of oh god why um and i assume at some i've never survived long enough to die of hunger or thirst um because i haven't been bothered to cloud uh, to you know sofa glitch for that long or couch glitch depending on where you're from um yeah <coughs> coughing Ooh, a car <gasps> a car i could probably kill this guy i didn't know that zombies scream so much if you um no, no die if you uh, made so much noise, I've never experienced that to such a degree. Um, hmm, car. Okay, I'll take that at some point. If I can hopefully maybe get a gun or something. Um, I don't know if they're drawn to flashlights, so I'm not going to bother. <gasps> a travel pack! Oh, fuck it! No, I... Oh my god. A travel pack may be so useful. I might have more than four slots to carry things right now. And you don't get loads of carry space. I have four slots right now. Unless I, that carry pack... Helped. Oh, son of a bitch! No, no. Okay, I'm gonna. Um. Oh shit! Are there any zombies around? I almost just died. Um. Yeah. Okay. Equip. Okay. I put that on. Oh, now I have more slots. Oh no! 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 no. Oh, that sucks. I'm dead. Hmm. Oh. It, okay, that does make sense. Maybe eventually, if you kind of slowly gain travel packs, this could be a game I could actually play and not die at. Um, also, you probably shouldn't do what I do and sprint constantly, because you'll get this sort of uh, thing where you run out of energy and get killed by zombies. Um, that's quite a problem for me. Hopefully I can go and find my travel pack. I really want my travel pack. That would make this game infinitely easier, because four slots is not a lot of slots. Um, I probably just kind of overlooked them in the past. Or just haven't seen them because they blend with the two colors in this game. Um, yeah, it is. But the nice thing about it is it's not like um, DayZ in, well, in terms of graphics. Because I know the, the graphics aren't good. Um, but it's not trying to take itself serious in terms of graphics. Seriously, that's not how you speak. Um, so it doesn't seem like, oh, this is annoying PS2 stuff that's being sold to me as a real game. This is a free game with just fun graphics, I guess. And look, it is fun graphics. And, okay, I'm actually punching zombies to death. Yeah, if you get them in a line, you can kill them, but I have lost most of my health, so... And they could be behind me, because I'm not paying attention. I'm paying attention to the imminent threat. My travel pack. Okay. There, you motherfucker, you... Travel pack stealing son of a bitch. You gotta really. It, it, I bet I, it feels like it'll be a grind at first. It is a grind at first, as you can see. Until you find some guns, and then those are used up really quickly. And then you're fucked. But a car would help. Um, really don't want to die. That's something I would really like to not do once. Um, although I imagine eventually you'll die. It does seem like a. Very event, very like a zombie apocalypse would be actually. Um, if zombie. Oh shit! Brick. Oh, corner glitch. I found some kind of glitch. Okay, good. Thank God. Sofas. Um. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Probably gonna die now. Yeah. In a very. Uh, yeah, I was saying it would seem kind of like what a zombie apocalypse would be if the zombie apocalypse made everything bad graphics. And it does have this fish eye on, actually. This fish eye camera. It's like, uh, if you look at that tree, it's slowly expanding. And it's not... And once you've noticed it, you can't stop noticing it. It's a very... F yeah, I don't know what the fish eye camera is about. Um, it's not in a very weird way. But, yeah, I imagine if uh, there was a zombie apocalypse, it wouldn't be like... Because everyone's like, oh, I'd be great in a zombie apocalypse. They probably wouldn't. They'd probably just die, kind of like this. And then you'd get a gun, and you wouldn't know how to use the gun, and then you'd die. Because um, that's how zombie apocalypses would probably go down. 
Um, and then we'd just be a nice little world of zombies, and everyone would get along because they don't have any brains to eat. Um, so that, and they're already dead, so they can't die, and they don't really desire power. So everything would be great. Yeah, I'm pro zombie. Ooh, brown pants. Nice. Um, that's brown trousers if you're British. Oh look, I've been here before. Okay, so this might not be procedurally generated. Good, I can finally put on some trousers. I don't know why I keep waking up naked next to a seashell. Um, kind of sounds like my trip to Vegas. Uh, finding out things about me every day. And they are, there are masses, so I assume you can become over-encumbered. And there is crafting. I've never got far enough to actually learn to craft, because I always die. But that is something. If you go in here, there's also crafting and skills. I have... Oh, I'll get some... Survival skills. Nice. Nice. Hardcore. Alright. Right, I need to gun. I need to gun. Ooh, I need to get more clothes. But what I need right now is to gun. And punch! I think punching might stun them. That could be useful. I just need to get in a car. Um, yeah. I'll just grab a car then, I guess. Uh, yeah. Okay, let's go. Don't know how to... Okay, reverse, reverse, reverse. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. And I have 5% fuel. That could be annoying. J turn. Go. Yeah, bitches. 4% fuel. Nice. That's gonna be a problem, I bet. 3% fuel. Well, I'm just getting out of here. Alright. 2% fuel. Wow, this car burns fuel really fast. Um, hmm. I assume you get like tanks. I have been to a military base before. It is quite nice. Uh, I haven't really had time to explore much of the landscape, but it does get kind of interesting. Anyway, I am screwed out of fuel and probably not good enough to do much more in this. Um, but I do urge you to, you know, get this. And if you're better than me and actually know that you can survive in this, please tell me because I'd like to, you know, eventually do something with this other than spend five minutes finding a gun then firing the gun, and then dying. Um, it gets a little generic doing that, but it is a confusing game, and I don't know how I feel about it, so um, I, I don't know. It's it's a nice game. If you like this sort of thing, you'll probably like it, and if you don't, you'll, you don't. So that's a very concise, terrible review. So I hope you've enjoyed this video, um, and, you know, if you've liked it, drop a like, and so on and so forth. This has been... You turned. I will see. You turned? <laughs> no, it's been unturned. I, uh, I'm tired. I'll see you next time.